Hello YouTubers, this is the Trian60 Fun in today's tutorial we will be talking about performing titrations for your chemical chemistry practicals. Okay, so let's begin. So the first step you do you'd be doing during the titration experiment is to rinse all the apparatus with distilled water. The next step is to get the standard solution. For example, we'll get a 0.1 normal NaOH or any other solution. During most of the reactions, you'll be provided with the standard solution, but uh, you can prepare the standard solution as well. Then after that, uh, we have to take the standard solution and transfer uh, around 10 to 20 ml or any known uh, volume that you can measure using a pipette and then uh, transfer it into a round, uh, transfer it from the round bottom flask to the early mayor flask using a pipette. You will then add a few drops of a suitable indicator like phenolphthalein or methyl orange as per the reaction involved. Then after that we'll fill the burette with the solution of unknown strength up to the zero mark. We'll let the liquid flow from the burette con with constant stirring of the flask until a characteristic color change is observed. We'll note the volume of the liquid dispensed from the burette. And we'll, the repeat, we'll repeat the experiment until we get the same reading each time. And then we'll use the formula N1V1 equals to N2V2. Here you can see that N1V1 is the known normality and volume. The volume is the volume which you took in the Erlen Meyer flask, and the concentration was known as you had taken from the round bottom flask. And this N2V2 will be the unknown normality which will be found out. And V2 will be the volume uh, of the liquid dispensed from the burette. And then we'll find the required information from there. And it's done. Thanks for watching. For more videos, visit www.thetreeand60fund.webly.com or www.youtube.com slash user slash the 3 and 60 fund. And please do not forget to subscribe us. Thanks for watching. Thank you.